Dear brothers and sisters in Christ, we welcome you to join us today to pray the glorious mystery of the Rosary together. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth. I believe in Jesus Christ, the only Son of our Lord, who was conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell, and on the third day, he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven, and is seated at the right hand of God the Father Almighty. From there, he will come again to judge living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of sins, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. And blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. The first glorious mystery, the resurrection. We offer you, O Lord Jesus, this first decade in honor of your glorious resurrection. And we ask of you, through this mystery and through the intercessions of your Holy Mother, for a deep and lively faith. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sin, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thy mercy. The second glorious mystery, the Ascension. We offer you, O Lord Jesus, this second decade in honor of your glorious Ascension. And we ask of you, through this mystery and through the intercessions of your Blessed Mother, for a firm hope and a great longing for heaven. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now, and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now, and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now, and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now, and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now, and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now, and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, as now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sin. Save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thy mercy. The third glorious mystery, the descent of the Holy Spirit. We offer you, O Holy Spirit, this third decade in honor of the mystery of Pentecost. And we ask of you, through this mystery and through the intercessions of Mary, your most faithful spouse, for your holy wisdom, so that we may know, really love, and practice your truth and make all others share in it. Amen. 
Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sin, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thy mercy. The fourth glorious mystery, the Assumption of Mary. We offer you, O Lord Jesus, this fourth decade in honor of the glorious Assumption of your Holy Mother, body and soul, into heaven. And we ask of you, through this mystery and through her intercessions, the gift of true devotion to her, and that we may live and die in your grace. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now, and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, as now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sin. Save us from the fires of hell. Lead all our souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thy mercy. The fifth glorious mystery, the coronation of Mary. We offer you, O Lord Jesus, this fifth decade in honour of the glorious coronation of your Holy Mother. And we ask of you, through this mystery and through her intercession, the grace of final perseverance, and that we may attain the crown of glory prepared for us in the life hereafter. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruits of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruits of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruits of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. 
Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruits of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruits of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thy mercy. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, hail our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee did we cry, poor vanishing of Eve. To thee did we send out our sighs, moaning and weeping in these valleys of tears. Turn thy most gracious advocate, thy eyes of mercy towards us. And after this, our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O lovely, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray, O God, whose only begotten Son, by his life, death and resurrection has purchased for us the rewards of eternal salvation. Grant we beseech you that meditating upon this mystery in the most holy rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary. We may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you for praying with us. Good evening, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the 12th Sunday in Ordinary Time. The Mass Intentions for the Faithful Departed, Rose Lee, Betram Sia, Gladys Sia, Luz Rajadure, Mary Philomena Beauty Chua, Lazarus De Silva, Alphonsin Lazarus De Silva, Teddy Thomas, Mr. and Mrs. Bob Tomasias, Eliza Tomasias, James Tomasios, Anthony Michael, Lalishmi Griza, All Souls in Purgatory, Mrs. Rani Sundaram, All Those Who Have Died from COVID-19. For Special Intentions, Baby Luke Lim, Liu Hui Leng, Healthy Mother and Child, Daniel Lim, Daniel Liu, Jenny Chua, Josephine Claudia, Su Xiao Han, Terry Liu, Felicia Tan, Thion Liu, Valerie Liu, Intentions of the Donor, Conversions of Sinners, Vincent Yeo, Don Sim Bing Huat, Donna Elizabeth Sim, Lucy, Lucy Lazarus Sim, Half Steel Limited and All Staff, All Destitute Children in the World, Good Health and Well Being. All senior citizens, good health and well-being. All migrant workers in Singapore for their good well health and well-being. Priests in Our Lady of Lourdes for their good health and well-being. All fathers, good health and well-being. S. Devendran, birthday blessings. Josephine Martin, speedy recovery and a good health. Adrian Francis Sullivan for safety and for all people suffering from COVID-19, Tan Siu Yen for a speedy recovery, and God's mercy and compassion on the world. For Thanksgiving, Audrey, Gabriel, J. Xavier, St. Benedict, Dr. and Mrs. C.K. Raju and family, Father Michael Sitaram, Florence Tan, Michael family, all fathers, and Marie Yap, for admission into the University of Social Sciences. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. 
The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. And with your spirit. A very good evening to all of you as we come together to celebrate this Eucharist. And also a very good morning to all those who will be watching this online Mass on Sunday morning. We gather once again to celebrate the Eucharist. We gather because of the love of God. Yesterday we celebrated the Sacred Heart of Jesus. The love of God poured out for all of us. Today we are called once again. Not to be afraid, but to go out and proclaim the good news because we have Jesus in our hearts. So let us pray and ask the Lord to strengthen us with faith and with the whole energy that we have in God's name to proclaim his name and God's kingdom. Together we pray. I confess to Almighty God and to you, my brothers and sisters, that I have greatly sinned in my thoughts and in my words, in what I have done and in what I have failed to do. Through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault. Therefore, I ask Blessed Mary, ever virgin, all the angels and saints, and you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. And may Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace to people of goodwill. We praise you, we bless you, we adore you, we glorify you. We give you thanks for your great glory. Lord God, heavenly King, O God, Almighty Father, Lord Jesus Christ, only begotten Son, Lord God, Lamb of God, Son of the Father, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. You take away the sins of the world, receive our prayer. For you are seated at the right hand of the Father, have mercy on us. For you alone are the Holy One, you alone are the Lord, you alone are the Most High, Jesus Christ, with the Holy Spirit, in the glory of God the Father. Amen. Let us pray. Grant, O Lord, that we may always revere and love your holy name, for you never deprive of your guidance. Those you set firm on the foundation of your love, through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. The first reading, a reading from the prophet Jeremiah. Jeremiah said, I hear so many disparaging me, terror from every side. Denounce him, let us denounce him. All those who used to be my friends watched for my downfall. Perhaps he will be seduced into error. Then we will master him and take revenge. But the Lord is at my side, a mighty hero. My opponents will stumble, mastered, confounded by their failure. Everlasting, unforgettable disgrace will be theirs. But you, Lord of hosts, you who probe with justice, who scrutinize the loins and heart, let me see the vengeance you will take on them for I have committed my cause to you. Sing to the Lord, praise the Lord, for he has delivered the soul of the needy from the hands of evil men. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. The responsorial psalm, the response is, In your great love, answer me, O God. In your great love, answer me, O God. 
It is for you that I suffer taunts, that shame covers my face, that I have become a stranger to my brothers, an alien to my mother's sons. I burn with zeal for your house, and taunts against you fall on me. In your great love, answer me, O God. This is my prayer to you, my prayer for your favour. In your great love, answer me, O God, with your help that never fails. Lord, answer for your love is kind. In your compassion, turn towards me. In your great love, answer me, O God. The poor, when they see it, will be glad. And God-seeking hearts will revive. For the Lord listens to the needy and does not spurn his servants in their chains. Let the heavens and the earth Give him praise, the sea and all its living creatures responds. In your great love, answer me, O God. The second reading, a reading from the letter of St. Paul to the Romans. Sin entered the world through one man, and through sin, death. And thus death has spread through the whole human race because everyone has sinned. Sin existed in the world long before the law was given. There was no law and so no one could be accused of the sin of law breaking. Yet death reigned over all from Adam to Moses even though their sin, unlike that of Adam, was not a matter of breaking a law. Adam prefigured the one to come, but the gift itself considerably outweighed the fall. If it is certain that through one man's fall so many died, it is even more certain that divine grace coming through the one man, Jesus Christ, came to as many as an abundant free gift. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Please stand for the gospel and acclamation. Alleluia, alleluia. The word was made flesh and lived among us. To all who did accept him, he gave power to become children of God. Alleluia, alleluia. The Lord be with you. And also with you. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Glory to you, Lord. Jesus instructed the twelve as follows, Do not be afraid, for everything that is now covered will be uncovered, and everything now hidden will be made clear. What I say to you in the dark, tell in the daylight. What you hear in whispers, proclaim from the housetops. Do not be afraid of those who kill the body, but cannot kill the soul. Fear him, rather, who can destroy both body and soul in hell. Can you not buy two sparrows for a penny? And yet not one falls to the ground without your father knowing it. Every hair on your head has been counted. So there is no need to be afraid. You are worth more than hundreds of sparrows. So if anyone declares himself for me in the presence of men, I will declare myself for him in the presence of my Father in heaven. But the one who disowns me in the presence of men, I will disown in the presence of my Father 
in heaven. And this, my dear friends, is the good news of our Lord Jesus Christ. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. It happens in some friendships. It, appear, it happens in some marriages. It happens in schools. Friends or spouses, for some reason, have not learned complete trust in one another. Their relationship, for many, but for a good number, there is that trust, of course. But for a good number also, there is many who are waiting for the other to make a mistake. And then it goes, there you see, and you are ready to declare that the friendship or marriage is over. This happens in schools, adolescents growing up, sometimes in marriages, in friendships in the offices. Friendships last until there are crises. And this describes our relationship with Jesus. Let me, uh, a story will help you to understand this. The story about the love between a great soldier who was stranded in the desert with a, with a tiger. And they first met, they were cautious of each other, frightened to death. But gradually, they grew closer to one another. How the tiger came out into the desert, I do not know. It was told in the story. They played together, they hunted together, and even they looked at each other with loving eyes, as they say. After a time, kept going on. But for some reason or another, the soldier always kept a knife by his side. At a certain point of the story, the tiger was jealous when the soldier started playing with an eagle that was flying low. So how do things come about between this mismatch pair in the desert? Well, the two great passions, this great persons ended as great passions ended by a misunderstanding. Because one always suspects the other of infidelity. They harbor lots of things secretly in themselves and they quarrel and then they part through sheer stubbornness. So one day the soldier just tried to make a move which was very important. But then the tiger just turned around and with his sharp teeth grabbed the soldier's leg and bit into it. But the soldier took out the knife and stabbed the tiger in the neck. The tiger groaned, dying. And with a loud cry, it froze the heart of the soldier. And the soldier saw the tiger's eyes looking at him. And he felt very, very sad. See, we, we immediately can think of this story as our own lives. Perhaps the friendships that we have wounded. Because we were quick to interpret 
whatever the person did or the motives that were happening so we never trusted them what about a christ in our lives many people argue a passion in youth they are, they have that passion for christ when they are in youth when they join all these groups and all that but then they send they begin to argue about the presence of god in here in the world and slowly with all that false understandings that they receive or the fake news that they receive they are ready to plunge the knife into christ we hear of a man who says he's not going for mass because there are hypocrites there in the church so there are definitely there are everywhere there are hypocrites and so he will stab christ too all along we can see his friendship with christ was superficial so he's quick with the knife we hear of a man who doesn't believe in god because his marriage is over he did something wrong and so he doesn't believe in god he's quick with the knife we hear of a woman who suddenly discovers sickness and suffering and she turns again god against god now god is at fault she is quick with the knife we hear of a person who met a bad catholic an irritating priest who always scolds them or hurts them with all his words don't look at me like that i'm not the one huh? and they conclude this is religion there is no trust he is quick with the knife and there are catholics who for some reason have kept their knives at their side waiting because their faith is not genuine in jesus christ deep down the relationship always ends up in misunderstandings for example we only want jesus when we need him and when we cannot get anything out of it we are quick with the knife you see jesus wants us all the time all the time we have put him on the cross but he has saved us so that is why today's gospel Jesus has come to speak of the father's love the father who had not forgotten him the father who has given us life through his son Jesus Christ and that is why today Jesus speaks to each one of us to go forth to proclaim the good news you see when god calls you to a ministry in the church or even in your office to that ministry that you are doing do not treat it like you have to do like a job this is my timing this is my work and that's it so if you have a job give it up and find a ministry as they say God does not want us to be stuck in the job. He wants us to be faithful in the ministry. So you see we don't change God's message. This message changes us. And that is what Jesus says today. He wants us to change. And that is why he says do not be afraid.
Together, my dear friends, let us stand as in our own homes, in our own places. As people of God, let us profess that faith loudly and clearly. I believe, I believe in one God, God the, the Father, Father Almighty, Almighty, maker of, of heaven and earth, of all things visible and invisible. I believe in one Lord Jesus Christ, the only, the only begotten Son of God, born of the Father before all ages, God from God, light from light, true God, God from true God, God, begotten not made, consubstantial with the Father. Through to him all things were made, for us men and for our salvation. He came down from heaven, and by the Holy Spirit, was incarnate of the Virgin Mary and became man. For our sake he was crucified under Pontius Pilate. He suffered death and was buried, and rose again on the third day, in accordance with the Scriptures. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of the Father. He will come again in glory to judge the living and the dead, and his kingdom will have no end. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Lord, the giver of life, who proceeds from the Father and the Son, who with the Father and the Son is adored and glorified, who has spoken to the prophets. I believe in one holy, Catholic and apostolic church. I confess one baptism for the forgiveness of sins, and I look forward to the resurrection of the dead, the life of the world to come. Amen. God knows our supplications before we voice them. For all who are called to lead the church, working to evangelize all who seek the truth, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord graciously, graciously hear us. For those called to government service, striving to lead in ways of peace and justice, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, graciously hear us. For all who long for honorable employment and strive for a living wage, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, graciously hear us. For this parish community, as we do our best to reflect the face of Christ to others, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, graciously hear us. God, you are the truth, the spirit of truth. Hear the prayers we offer with hearts buoyed by your constant love. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Let us pray, my dear brothers and sisters, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifices of your heads for the praise and glory of his name, for our good and the good of all his church. Receive, O Lord, the sacrifice of conciliation and praise, and grant that cleansed by its action, we may make offering of our heart 
pleasing to you through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just our duty and our salvation always and everywhere to give you thanks. Lord holy father almighty and eternal god for although you have no need of our praise yet our thanksgiving is itself your gift since our praises add nothing to your greatness but profit us for salvation through Christ our lord and so in company with the choirs of angels we praise you and with joy we proclaim holy holy holy, holy lord god of hosts Heaven and earth are full of your glory. Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy therefore these gifts we pray by sending down your spirit upon them like the dew fall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our lord jesus christ at the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion he took bread and giving thanks broke it and gave it to his disciples saying take this all of you and eat of it for this is my body which will be given up for you In a similar way when supper was ended he took the chalice and once more giving thanks he gave it to his disciples saying take this all of you and drink from it for this is the chalice of my blood the blood of the new and eternal covenant which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins do this in memory of me the mystery of faith we, we proclaim, proclaim your death o lord and, and profess your resurrection until you come again therefore as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection we offer you lord the bread of life and the chalice of salvation giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of christ we may be gathered into one by the holy spirit Remember Lord your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity together with Francis our pope William our bishop and all the clergy remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy welcome them into the light of your face have mercy on us all we pray that with the blessed virgin mary mother of god with blessed saint joseph her spouse with the blessed apostles and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your son jesus christ Through him and with him and in him O God almighty father in the unity of the holy spirit all glory and honor is yours forever and ever Amen Together my dear friends at the service command and formed by divine teaching we now pray Our Father who art in heaven hallowed be thy name thy kingdom come thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil deliver us lord we pray from every evil graciously grant peace in our days that by the help of your mercy we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our savior 
Jesus Christ. For the, for the kingdom, kingdom the, the power, and the glory are yours, now, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. Peace be with you. Lamb of God. God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, grant us peace. Behold the Lamb of God. Behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should come under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed. Let us pray. Renewed and nourished by the sacred body and precious blood of your Son, we ask of your mercy, O Lord, that what we celebrate with constant devotion may be our sure pledge of redemption through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. And may Almighty God bless you all, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Let us all go in peace to love and serve the Lord. Thanks be to God.